Berlin wouldn't exist without music. I cannot imagine this. <laughs> Berlin got, uh, got a special kind of sound. At the end of the 70s, beginning of the 80s, artists like Tangerine Green, David Bowie, Iggy Pop, who lived here, they also influenced um, this electronic music scene. There were a lot of radio shows where the radio men, for example, explained how all these new tools, electronic tools, will work, how you can work with a synthesizer. When you have freedom, creativity and, and artists, something really interesting can happen and that's what happened in the 90s. The history of Berlin is a very special kind of history and it is a certain element in why Berlin nowadays is the way it is. It has a lot to do with these open spaces which were here around uh, when the wall came down. And there was this kind of crazy music from the US, from Detroit and from, and from Chicago and the people just loved it and they started to go into some basements and just play the music. We had these huge free spaces in Eastern, in Eastern Berlin and you had these kind of many people who just wanted to have a good time. And this kind of attitude still is the foundation of how it works. Berlin is definitely a place to find yourself in music. I think the old time is done now. I really love the old techno music, but for a young producer like me, it's better to look in the future than to look in the past. You have so many kinds of electronic music here in Berlin. We have people from Australia, England, America. That's, that's why Berlin is Berlin, I think. We're quite different, I would say, yeah. because I'm way more techno. I like groovy music, I like um, deep bass lines and uh, I hate monotone music. I think here is the new center in this music of the world where, um, because there are so many people and DJs from all over the world coming to Berlin, meet each other, work together on new projects and the, new biggest, uh, the newest and biggest labels are from Berlin. You can hear it in my productions that I really got influenced by the city. My, my production became harder before I was making kind of tech house and now it's really dark. I'm not, I'm not even trying, it's going to techno clubs and there are so many things going on here that kind of like influences my productions. We had more than one and a half million people who were dancing, who were raving at the love parade. I mean, it's incredible. 